So here we are, just days away from DBW Merry Mayhem. And I know exactly who I'm facing now as a result of Danger Zone. Chaz Evans versus Zach the Hellhound Romig. And Zach Romig puts on a hell of a show and ends up being the victor. Kudos to you, Zach Romig. But I think the person who's going to benefit from this the most is Chaz Evans because he doesn't have to be in the ring with a prophet, Mr. Judgment. The DBW World Champion, Mr. Judgment. The two-time longest reigning DBW World Champion, Mr. Judgment. You see, Zach Romig, you have literally walked up to the gates of hell. And I am waiting for you there, right at the entrance. And you will not get past me. Oh no, Zach the Hellhound Romig. You will not succeed in your quest. Your efforts will go in vain. Because you will not succeed in becoming the DBW World Champion. <laughs> well, you'll see, I don't know how many times I have to say it. The prophet of purgatory, Mr. Judgment. The Alpha, the Omega. Cannot be beaten by any mere mortal. And you, Zach Romig, although superior in that ring, you are nothing but a mere mortal. I am immortal. I live forever. <laughs> For you see, Zach Romig... All the stars have aligned in your favor. And you'll see, I have seen deep into your soul. And I've seen your future. <laughs> and unfortunately for you, it ends by my hands and merry mayhem. As you can come ever so close to capturing the holy grail of backyard wrestling, the DBW World Championship. But you, just like all the rest, all the other mortals of this pathetic world will fall short of getting this. For you see, it was your own mistakes to even let me challenge for this. For you see, victory was certain. And when victory is certain with Mr. Judgment, it is infinite. It is always certain. Zach Romig, Merry Mayhem. Three stages of purgatory match. The first pinfall, a normal match. Victory. The second pinfall, which is all we will need, is a falls count anywhere match. <laughs> so I can beat you in the ring, outside the ring, down the street, in the center of the universe. It doesn't even matter. <laughs> and should you be so lucky to have it get to a third match, a last man standing match. <laughs> well, I guess I don't even know if those stipulations apply to you because you're not a man. You're not a man at all. You're nothing but a little bitch. Zach Romig, <laughs> I am going to destroy you and make an example out of you. As I walk into Merry Mayhem, the DBW World Champion, and I walk out the DBW World Champion. <laughs> For you see, Zach Romig, whether it be by my hands, with the assistance of the grace of God, or whether it be by my hands, by the almighty power of the Leviathan. I will destroy you and consume your soul once again. For well, you see, no mortal can beat Mr. Judgment and a merry mayhem. I will do as I've done time and time again. I will destroy your worthless caucus and throw it all over the ring and make you an example of what happens when you step into the ring with the prophet of purgatory, the DBW world champion, Mr. Judgment. <laughs> so as each of you mortals sit there and bear witness in a couple days to merry mayhem, 
<laughs> Nothing will be merry for Zach Romig. <laughs> for I am the prophet of purgatory. I am the heel of heels. And I am the destroyer of this world and the consumer of souls. <laughs> so concludes this sermon of your, your, your DBW world champion, <laughs> Mr. Judgment. And I will walk in to Mary Mayhem walk out of Merry Mayhem and walk in to Total Domination 5. Your DBW World Champion. <laughs> Courtesy of Mr. Judgment. Boom. <laughs> Filth bags. <laughs>